Hello, I hope you guys are all doing great. This is the nail art design we're going to be working on today. Let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is apply this frosty pink polish by NYC called Love Letters over the side of my nail. Now over the area where I applied the pink nail polish, I'm going to make a stripe dividing this area and I'm using a black color along with a striper brush. Next, I'm going to be outlining the shape of a French manicure. I'm just filling in the outline. Once your outline is complete, it's time to fill it in. And I'm going to be filling it in with a black color. Now going back to my striper brush, I'm going to be painting a series of black lines coming in sideways. Now coming in the opposite way, I'm going to create another series of black stripes. This is the background I chose for both my designs. The first one we're going to begin with is the ivy green design. Using a green color along with a striper brush, I'm going to create a stripe in the area that divides the two colors. And then I'm just gonna bring it up towards the side. I'm gonna go over it a little bit one more time, just following the same exact line. Using the same striper brush, I'm going to paint fine, thin, little green leaves. Starting in the corner, I'm going to begin a line of white dots outlining my French manicure area. Starting on the lower side under the vine I'm also going to be painting another pattern of dots. Using a darker green color I'm just going to paint a thin green line in the center of each of the green leaves. And that's it for painting the green vine part of this nail art design. Now let's move over to painting the one stroke flower part of this nail art design. I'm going to dip half of my brush in the white and the other half in the pink. Now I'm just going to flatten my brush to my plate and bring it towards one direction. Just bringing it towards one direction, I'm going to flip my brush and do the same exact thing. This will assure me that my brush will be fully loaded. So I'm just doing the same exact thing. And I'm going to dip it one more time. And now I'm ready to use it. With the white color on top, I'm going to begin with my first flower petal. So I'm going to place my brush flat and I'm going to begin moving it very slowly coming towards the side and just barely moving it. So I'm just doing that, just shaking my brush little by little and ending it there. I'm just going to go over it one more time doing the same exact thing just taking my time and just swooshing my brush very carefully taking my time and ending there again. Now I'm going to be working on my following flower petal. I'm going to dab my brush and I'm going to bring this one a little bit more towards the center of my fingernail and swooshing it, swooshing it, doing the same exact thing and I'm going to end it right about there around where I have the French manicure smile line. I'm going to go over it one more time and I just want my colors to be a little more vibrant. 
So I'm just swooshing my brush the same exact way and I'm gonna end it exactly in the same area. Right there. Now I'm gonna be working on my third flower petal. I'm tapping my brush and I'm gonna begin doing the same exact thing, swooshing my brush very slowly, little by little, bringing it towards the side, rounding it off, and I'm gonna end it over the corner area and I'm gonna go over it one more time as well. Now I'm going to be working on a second row of smaller flower petals. So I'm going to come in and these strokes, I'm going to make them a little bit smaller, but following the same pattern. So there's my first flower petal. I'm going to move a little bit farther down, dab it, dab it, and do the same exact thing. Now in the center of these, I'm going to be painting a smaller flower petal. And one more over the opposite side. Now in the center of my flower, you can leave it like that. What I'm gonna do is just a half letter C and another one coming in the opposite direction, just to give it a little more detail. Now using my liner brush, I'm going to outline each of my flower petals. Now it's just time to paint your flower vine wherever you'd like. Now I'm just going to paint a couple of green leaves. paint a thin green stripe in the center of each of my leaves. Now I'm just going to add a couple of dots in the color white. I decided to add another green leaf vine over this area, so I could just paint another little green leaf over here. Now I'm just adding a thin green stripe over this tiny green leaf. And that's it. All you have left to do is to apply your top coat sealing in your design. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and try out this nail art design using your favorite colors. Be safe and I'll see you next time. Bye.